If he is not the same, how would he know what his photographer's name is? By your Omoborio speaks. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please sus subscribe to our channel. By your Omoborio the official photographer of former President Muhammad Buhari, has dismissed the claims that Buhari was a clone called Jibreen of Sudan. It should be recalled that the rumors began to spread after Buhari returned from a medical trip in the UK 2017. In the UK in 2017, and some people began to claim that a man who had returned to the country was not the real Buhari. Buhari was flown to the UK for treatment in May 2017 and returned to the country. Speaking with, during the recent interview with the channel's television, which was also carried out by Vanguard, Bayo said that when Buhari returned to the country, he was still the same man to him. Speaking about the difference he noticed, speaking about the difference he noticed, he said that Buhari lost weight when he came back but did begin weight and that their conversation was still the same. He said, and I quote, I still had this conversation with one elderly woman over the Christmas break. She carried me into a kitchen and asked, is he really Buhari? And I tried to explain to her, for instance, I'm his photographer. If he changed, I should be able to know. For me, it is more about telling the story of a man that he went and he came back. He was still the same to me. He lost weight and he gained weight. Our conversation was still the same. When he didn't see me, he asked, where is Bayo? So if he's not the same, how would he know what his photographer's name is are we still on this issue oh, please oh. are we still on this issue ha. because to me this is not what is bedveling us now this person is no longer on the seat nigeria we like giving our attention to everything and if you keep backing at if you keep you know backing at everything that is thrown your way, you are, we are not going to get anywhere. Even as a human being, if you keep backing at everybody who, you know, triggers you, you are not going to get ahead in life. Sincerely, we have a lot on our plate. There is insecurity in the country that is spreading like wildfire. The insecurity, the, the rate as, at which it is spreading, and it is not like they are doing anything in particular to make sure it does not affect the whole country. Everybody is just sit down, they not sit down, they look then they. People who the thing has not touched, they're thinking it is, you know, there are some people who don't believe these things are real. Do you understand? Then we are coming out now to talk about Buhari when we are in the season or we're in the administration of Tunumbu. To me, it is very, very it is uncalled for. This convo is uncalled for. The man will sit down there, you know, be Buhari again. You don't go in us. People wait too many. Okay, people wait too many evil. Don't make food know they do anything for their body. Anyway, I don't believe he was the real Buhari. I think the first Bubu generally wants to fight corruption. Now then, Sabi. The thing is, unfortunately, we are not in, or should I say fortunately, we no longer the for Buhari administration again. Natsurambu and administration. Now we do it in. Now we do. I think it was when the man was very sick and when he when he hit alien parts of okay, when his alien part of body or his alien body parts were removed and replaced medically by our new colonialist Britain. Hence the transformation you see in that picture. In fact, Madame had to run and relocate to Dubai because she couldn't withstand the strength of the new improved Oga in the other room. Money and power is good, Jerry. I beg, leave them and make you enjoy the last lap of your life. Now, you know, they talk that one, no? Even, uh, what's the kind of Buhari from wherever she did? She know this, she know they okay. She's still not safe till now. Maybe they lose them. The team say they don't come out there. I still don't want to say no go prove this man. Mm -hmm. When we are going to be talking about this man, I say, when Tunumbu don't call and say, oh, guys, oh, yeah, they go to FCC office. But if Tunumbu not talk to me, Talking about him is to total waste of time. We should be channeling that energy to talk about how we are going to solve the problem of this country. We have a lot on our plate. A whole lot. 
Okay, dead or alive, Buhari is over. Let us face today. Thank you. People are dying in great numbers out of hardship, out of kidnapping, out of insecurity. Mr. President should do something to save the populace. Let him fix Nigeria's promise. He's still alive. God save us from this selfish government of I'm telling you, whether Buhari is dead or alive, whether he was his clone or was he, whether he's not his clone, like I said, except Tuembo wants to come in and wants to do what? Step up and, you know, probe him. And Queen Elizabeth commensurated with Nigerian and Biden said, I quote, it is only in Nigeria that a deep dead person can rule for six years without them knowing. This was on BBC News on September 20th. I beg you. I beg you. If you say Buhari is not dead, Google a minute silence for Buhari. Talk. Let's different surgery from cloning. Uh, uh, have we see on this issue? Kai, now what it make me not feel get ahead for this contributor so? Trivial issues are thrown under the bus. Why the ones that are not even trivial are being discussed? Why? We will drop this issue now. Huh. Do you want to go back to Buhari regime? Because I don't understand. How would you get your pay if you denied your client? <laughs> okay. Foolish inhuman. Nigerians should take heart. Who make this statement and on what ground? I beg run. Talk. Only fool with full knowledge of life, we agree that Buhari was cloned. Is it the first president in the world that was going to die if he died? How many resources her family may has to bribe all the international body in journalism to keep the secret? Some people are full of mischievous of mischievousness. Many of them have lost political patronage looking for a way to be relevant by talking jargons with fake agencies. We should continue believing in that direction of life without facing the reality. Abby? Even if you want to come as I can't say, you will die in no get. Look, now Nigerian money go use bribe them. That is if it happen. But me, this issue is not, this topic is not the topic I really want to venture into. Mm -hmm. It's not a topic. We have a lot, so, so much on our plates. People, when they kidnap, they say kidnap them. The former minister of, uh, what's the they call him? That is up and Tammy guy now. Which position you hold that time? What we said, I suppose they forefront now. Now they suppose they tell us, oh yeah, oh God. Use these people security. Uh, we use these people. I know number. Trace them. Use these people. Vivi and trace them. Now come outside. They gather money. Imagine make a minister. Maybe say now in the past maybe that they gather money. Maybe they use go pay ransom. And you know what's paying ransom to the kidnappers mean? To the family members, to those who are kidnapped, is a good thing. But to the kidnappers, is emboldening them. Is telling them come again. Eh? Thank you for doing business with us. Please come again. Now we think that's money be. All right, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We so say thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.